Are we live? And good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, we're back uh, for the second time tonight. We had a very exciting couple of races uh, in our Gran Turismo Sport um, Indian, uh, Indian Super GT Championship. Uh, today was tonight was round, and race two was. I mean, especially race two had us all on our toes, really jumping up and down. Um, <clears throat> and now we are just tuning in. For uh, <clears throat> we're just tuning in for our uh, our main race of, of the of the night, basically, which is our our ultimate our ultimate e super uh, superstars. Um, and we've we've gone live to Montreal in Canada. Um, the cars you're you're looking at right now are the Formula Renault three point five liter cars. We've got uh, twenty of the best racing drivers and gamers together competing against one another. We've got the likes of Narain Kartikeyan. Uh, Arjun Maini, Vishnu Prasad, Sohil Shah, Karthik Tarani, you know, guys, I mean, obviously, Naren and Naren needs, no, needs no introduction. Arjun, obviously, uh, has been in Formula 2 and now in world, the World Indian Championship. Uh, we've got uh, Karthik, Vishnu, and Sohil, all multiple champions. Then you've got the gamers who are Amit Kuti, who has been phenomenal over the last couple of weekends in, in all forms. Of, uh, of our of our racing series, we've got uh, Abhishek Dwaragnath who's been competitive right through. We've got Hari. We've got a bunch of guys, you know, and everyone's mixing it up. We've got youngsters like uh, Sai Sanjay uh, who come in as well, uh, really quick. We've got Adwait there, so you know, a lot going on. We, Silverstone, the testing, the, the the three days of testing we had in Silverstone was really was really good as well. Um, and now in Montreal, I mean, you know, they we we noticed the guys really mixing each other. And we're just coming to the end of, of testing, of, of official practice. We start qualifying at 9.05 p.m. We just got, we were watching Narain right now. On his, this, this livery he actually ran in 2004, the year before he got into Formula 1 in, 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 the, in the World Series Championship. At that time, it was under Nissan. I'm joined tonight by Alte Pere, Dylan. Um, Hello. And, and let, them take it, uh, let them take it forward for a bit from here. But really looking forward to tonight guys and then tune in and stay with us for the two races for qualifying in the two yeah. races thanks for the introduction arman uh, and hi dylan hi, uh, good hi. evening ladies and gentlemen uh Aditya patel here and uh, we're really excited for this evening we're super excited to have narain on board with us uh, i started my racing career with uh, narain's team nk racing so it, it's great to have him here on board we're going to have some exciting racing like arman said we just had a couple of great races in gran turismo uh, and now we're looking forward to some really good racing here at R Factor 2. Um, we've got a super strong grid. Uh, right now in uh, practice, we've got Amit, who's topped the practice session so far. He's a tenth quicker than uh, Arjun Maini. Uh, Amit's a gamer. He's, he's never really done much racing. So it's great to see someone like Amit up there. What do you say, Dylan? I mean, yeah, I would, uh, as Arman said, Arman pretty much uh, nailed it with that intro there. And uh, he did uh, mention Amit as well. Amit has just been extremely fast uh, all weekends around. Uh, obviously, with Assetto Corsa, he did have a bit of bad luck and uh, did have a couple spins there, especially Assetto Corsa, where it's so sensitive. And, uh, yeah, spins are very, very likely. Um, but, I mean, F1 as well, like uh, which was last weekend, he was just strong. Uh, first day, he had two second places, and then the second day, he had uh, two first places. So he's extremely, extremely fast, and now we can even see this weekend, he's uh, he's keeping that uh, potential up as well. And obviously, Arjun Maini was extremely fast and actually ended up winning the uh, driver standings uh, in Assetto Corsa. And uh, yeah, we, expect we should expect some really, really good racing from Arjun Maini and uh, Amit as well. I think we're just waiting on Arjun as you know he's he's just he's there in second actually. Sorry, I thought he wasn't in the lobby yet. But um I mean yeah, I think just look at the times guys. I'm sorry, I was just uh, focused on that. You know, they've come down to the late twenty twos, one hundred and twenty two point eight is what Amit is. You know, yesterday when we saw them in their first uh, first laps around the circuit, I think the quickest was uh, a low twenty three and that was, you know, really quick for us. And then suddenly today they they even found, they found more time and now I is, I think that's really quick, you know, and um, that's really just pushing the, the limits, really. And they found, they've definitely found some time on this. 
Um, everyone from uh, third onwards is actually bunched up quite a bit. But yeah, it's, I mean, I think what's really challenging about this race, I mean, you know, our fact is a little bit about the game. Our factor two is is not the newest of games, but it's the most it's the most used game in terms of uh, simulator programs uh, in high tech simulators as well. It's the most valued uh, and used program as well uh, because it's I think uh, it's one of the most realistic uh, real, uh, sim games out there, and it's quite difficult really. It can't sound a lot, and you have to get really. Now we're ready for qualifying, and let's just see what happens. I mean, it's uh, who, who's your money on, guys? Who's your I mean, uh, obviously, we, we should be expecting some really, really good racing from Arjun Mayani and Amit, as well as Sohil. Sohil was really, really strong. As, as, a, as, I, as I said, there was a lot of bad luck going around, and I think Sohil Shah just had a, uh, quite a bit of that as well. And uh, Sohil Shah was just extremely fast from that. And, um, yeah, it was just extremely great. If I'm not wrong, we're in the qualifying. Uh, Arman, uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, but, yeah, I, it's looking really, in, really uh, interesting. These guys are extremely fast. I mean, Amit talking about uh, you said everyone was in the low 123s today and they're pushing 122s now it was like the same in silverstone for formula one those guys were doing 126s and uh the p previous time was a 128 during practice and qualifying yeah, so, uh, practice uh, so, and stuff, so yeah <coughs> so remember they will go quick on qualifying because they're now they run a lighter fuel load as well uh so we do expect the times to be dropped another thing the liveries they're all custom liveries each per each each competitor has their own livery like i was talking about narains is, is from his 2004 uh, world series car so you know i mean it, it, i i think um it's our, our screen we've got a lot more informate information going on as well so i think our viewers can be well informed of who's in the lead who's setting the fastest lap we've got the ticker board at the, at the bottom so you know we're just trying to improve our weekend round and try to add more information to our viewers as well to to keep them in the loop of what's going on. Um, as we can see, everyone's just starting their flying lap. They, 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 when, when going on the pits, they were quite, they were bunched up, but now they've opened a gap. And uh, let's, let, I mean, yeah. So like I said, they're starting the flying lap. In about a minute and a half, we'll know exactly what uh, what times they, 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 they're going. They, they're going to start with. Um, yeah. Remember, this circuit is almost like a street circuit. There's no room for error. It's bumpy. There are walls right right next to you. There's no runoff area. You gotta really use the curves and really muscle the car around. Yeah, I agree with you. Like um, uh, Canada is a very very uh, curvy and it's got some nice straights, uh, especially after that hairpin. Um, but uh, you really have uh, you also have the wall of champions. So it's a really really interesting track. There's really no room for errors in these chicanes. So it's gonna be really really challenging for these drivers to keep it out of the wall. Um, but without, uh, with that being said, we have some really experienced uh, drivers as well as gamers here, so we can expect some really, really, uh, uh, really, really clean and great racing uh, going ahead into the race itself. Um, but I do want to mention, uh, just for everyone to know, we are having uh, some title uh, problems, so it's actually not GT Sport right now, it's uh, the All-Stars event with... Uh, Narayan Karthikeyan as well as uh, Arjun Maini and uh, obviously a bunch of other big names in Indian sport. Oh, we see someone going into the wall right there. And uh, yeah, so this is actually our factor too. We are in Montreal. It is uh, not GT Sport. I just wanted to put that out there for everyone. Uh, that's, that's, called, that's called the wall of champions, Dylan. You know, because I mean, there's so many drivers who've been in the wall there. Looking at that, I think it's so at Sohail who's just gone into an incident there. But the first lap, the first flying lap set by Arjun, is a uh, one minute twenty two point eight with those straight away in the ball game. You've got Amit there who's done a twenty two point nine. Narain uh, his first lap was a twenty four zero, but in practice he was doing a high twenty three. So maybe he'll, he'll he'll keep you know working towards it in a couple of laps. But yeah, Arjun and Amit straight away on the ball twenty two eight and twenty two nine, and then you have Narain with twenty four Adwait with a twenty four one. Uh, Sai with a 20, 1 minute 24.5. So, yeah, they're all coming together. Rowan's improved a lot, come to a 1 minute 25.2. He's getting the hang of this game in the circuit right now. So, um, yeah, I mean, the top the top half is going to be really close, I think. And remember, we, we've already seen Sol make a mistake. So, he needs to recoup himself and get back to it because we know he's quick. But just, you can't make a mistake right now. I yeah, agree. I mean, we've got 10 minutes. Uh, I agree, yeah, we've got 10 minutes now. And so he has got time to put a lap together. Uh, but we have seen that, uh, you know, Narin can be super quick. Um, and you have to remember, Narin's not really used to gaming. He hasn't done much gaming before. He's done uh, a bit of sim practice uh, when he was doing Formula 1 uh, and Super GT. But it's not something he's used to. Like a bunch of these guys who, who play games all the time. So they're just 
they're used to it you know they get they're used to getting the feel oh. through the steering wheel um, uh, narendra's used to getting the feel through his feet through his bum through his you know? bum so it makes a big difference yeah no oh, it's huge i mean i know you know it. i mean obviously because we we don't play on the same match but if we look at the newer generation and dylan, dylan be able to tell us about it as well like you know a lot of time for people like arjun and amit and all spend on the same is unbelievable really it's really you know uh, you know well advanced setup really yeah these guys these guys spend a lot i can tell uh these guys spend a lot of time racing and you know it's what they love to do as well especially during these uh, times with covid-19 it's the it's the perfect time to get your practice in and uh, you know obviously uh, esports racing is extremely competitive as well as real racing so it's really um it's when you're not it's something to do when you're not on the track but you still want that uh, feel for the car and uh, obviously we have uh, racing ge- uh, rigs and stuff so you can come really close to that it's not there as a really uh, too close to a real car but it's the closest you'll get 100% i mean um, yeah for especially for for, for gamers or, you know and, and during these times when you're not being you're not able to be in a race car for a very long for a for long period of time i think that's why someone like even rain who basically has managed to sort himself out with you know the basic or very basic setup but just to keep you know the the the, the muscles flowing and you know this just for muscle knowledge really basically they just keep it going and just to keep it, that competitive spirit going uh it's also great uh, for these young for these youngsters uh, like their exposure because i don't think they ever they would ever have an opportunity to race against you know people with so much cal- with such caliber and experience so i think it's great exposure for them as well and uh, you know just being from ultimately we're really proud to have put that up together and we're really thankful that these drivers uh have come on board really uh but as we can see qualifying settling down we we, we look at the top times who've come down to a 20 122.3 uh which is amit <laughs> and he's about half a second quicker than arjun who's 122.8 so he has not too much but amit's found a lot of time so he's done a done a, his first flying lap and he stayed away with p3 with a 123.5 sai with a 123.7 then you have abhishek dwaranath who's a very good gamer at 123.7 uh narain's come down to a 123.9 so finding his time and I, I'm, I'm sure by the end of the session he's going to be he's going to be a lot closer to Amit than than what we're looking at now. Then you have Saurav, Advait, Arya, a bunch of drivers, and Vishnu, a bunch of racing drivers who form up the top ten. All right, so oh. I'm on uh, to uh, just side track here. Um, obviously, we're in qualifying right now, uh, but I do want to ask you. Um, I haven't uh, kept up with schedule, so why don't you tell me and the viewers and everyone watching? Uh, what the format is for uh, today's race <coughs> so we've got uh, we've got a quali- uh, we've got qualifying which is a 10 minute session this this basically what is it does it derive it sets the grid for race 1 then we then uh, we've got race 1 which is uh, which is say about a uh, 10 lap race and then uh, <coughs> post race 1 what we have is race 2 but race 2 remember is a reversed it race top 8 will be reversed This is again to just mix things up to help guys who've had a bad qualifying session or had a bad race one to you know and you finish in the top 10 basically to give them a chance uh to starting at the front and just to create more racing or more more racing opportunities and to make it more exciting so yeah good mix there so we're in for for a good double header uh tonight uh remember tomorrow tomorrow we fly all the way to Brazil uh in Sao Paulo the Interlago circuit uh which is going to be really exciting as well uh, a lot of uh, a lot of fantastic formula one races have happened there and uh, it'll be interesting to see what what the, tw- the 20 guys here put out there tomorrow and, and close the chapter yeah absolutely and uh, and while you guys speak we're on board with narain kartike and how often do you get to do that this is actually <laughs> narain driving and watching him do it he's he's sitting in his house in his living room the funny part is he's using a, a logitech g27 he's sitting on a chair but but when you sit with him here you wouldn't even imagine that he's 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 using equipment like that it's it's unbelievable how he uses it to his advantage yeah it's fantastic i remember when he, when he first sent me a picture of that setup I, I, all i could do is laugh i tell him that what the, the kind of advancements everyone else had but uh, i remember when silverstone out of the first test he was quickest and i was like <laughs> wow okay so they were into it and uh, yeah call of uh, montreal is a little more complex but as you can see every lap is going quicker and quicker and uh, yeah live on board sessions he's at in quantum with over here we uh, game wise we're in montreal and coming to the last corner which is uh, the 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 chicken of champions really <laughs> the wall of champions man oh, narain just put in a 1 minute 23.5 and I, that's actually the quickest time i think narain's done so far 
Um, uh, are we at the end of qualifying? I think we could be close to the end of qualifying. Narendra's back in the pits. I think Sai's back in the pits. But one minute twenty three point five is really quick. Um, but while we speak, Amit's done a one minute twenty two point three. That's that's unbelievably fast time. Yeah. So I mentioned this earlier. He's pulled out half a second on Arjun. You know, they started off at the same time on the first lap, and then he just found that half a second. Which remember in qualifying they run a lighter fuel load, so they were definitely they were naturally going to be quicker than practice. But I expected I didn't expect such a big jump, you know. Um, but yeah, it's good to see. I mean, I'm not surprised with the top five, uh, the top six. Uh, but it's really great to see how close they are, and uh, and yeah, it's going to be a really exciting race as we to, towards the end of qualifying. So as I uh, I do want to touch on uh, obviously Narendra Kartik in Formula One, former Formula One driver and. Uh, Uh, you know he was also a part of the X1 league, and uh, it was just absolutely wonderful to have him on board, especially this weekend. And uh, you know, obviously he's got a makeshift setup here, and you know, uh, we're just glad that he's here. And you know, he's actually for someone who doesn't race on the simulator to be top six right now, especially when there's uh, no time left, uh, sessions over, everyone's putting in the last lap. Uh, to be top six at that moment is uh, really, really good. I mean. Uh, or he's the only practice I really think he's had uh, on this game, especially was uh, throughout this week uh, on the practice sessions in Silverstone. So yeah, he's really he may not have been uh, fastest in the beginning, but he's you can definitely tell that he's a quick learner and he is he's picked up his pace, especially from uh, the first uh, the first uh, minute of uh, the qualifying. But either way, we've pretty much finished. Uh, Qualifying now, everyone is just coming in and doing their last lap. Uh, Amit obviously on top uh, with a 122.3. We've seen him have a strong performance all throughout uh, the three weekends that we've done so far. He's been extremely, extremely uh, strong as well as Arjun Maini. Arjun Maini did not compete in uh, uh, week in two because that was on PS4. Um, so yeah, we only see him on uh, yeah. PC, and uh, yeah, we can see he's right behind Amit and just breathing down his neck right now. Yeah, so the checker flag is out. That means the official end of qualifying. And Arjun did find some time that he's done a twenty-two point four, but not enough to beat Amit. But yeah, just a tenth off. So he's closed but the gap. But hats down. off to Amit, guys! I yeah. mean, unbelievable job by Amit to put it on pole position in our first race. Our factor two all stars, Amit on pole. It's going to be a great race. I'm really looking forward. To it. Yeah, what a what, what a good effort that was! Just two flying laps and boom! Like that's all you need to do. Really professional stuff there. Um, yeah. They're all just forming up on the grid right now, and then we're going to be good to go, guys. <clears throat> Super stuff. I mean, I'm really looking forward to the start of this race. We've got 19 cars on the grid. I think somebody's missed out, but 19 cars on going to be a great race. That's a lot of cars going into turn one. We all know Montreal. <laughs> 19 cars going into turn one is oh. a lot of action. There we go. The lights are starting to go off. Three, four, five. Five lights and, and they're oh, off. it's the first race of the ultimate. He oh, there's a super start there. All, you can see from behind by Narain, uh, but Amit has taken the the whole shot into the lead. He has. Amit's got a really good start. Uh, I'm not sure. I think that's Arjun in second. But then I think I there was a lot of collision at the there. back. There yeah. was a lot of there was a big collision in the background there. A lot of lot of lot of guys went off. But that's Narain. I think Narain's in fourth. I think that was Advait in third and Narain in fourth with a big gap. But um, Okay, let, let, let's just take a second here. There's a full course yellow, so uh, everyone's got to slow down. No overtaking, so that means. Uh, yeah, I think we we may have a, a we, restart. We we might may have a restart. Yeah, just 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 talking the race towards here. Um, just waiting for their decision, really. But yeah, I mean, uh, great start. Um, uh, NK has made a. Uh, You know, two positions, and uh, Arjun and Maini, Arjun and uh, Amit have just uh, gotten away, pulled away from the group, and Advait has made up all the positions he could in uh, the start of the race. Uh, obviously, as we've said, we are uh, going to see if uh, the restart is going to happen. Yes, the restart is going to happen, and uh, yeah, that means that uh, yeah. everyone has a second yeah. chance. So it goes yeah, by the rules. It was a it chaotic start, there, yeah, guys. It goes so by the rules. I think the restart is. Yeah. It goes by the rules. I just want to explain this for our viewers, especially. It goes by the rules as well. That if there is a a big collision, you know, here we have of doing it because again, it's it's virtual. Uh, if there is a big collision in turn one, or if there's a technical glitch for for a couple of participants, then what we do is within the first lap itself, we are able to restart the race. If it goes beyond the first lap, we usually don't. But if there is a huge issue, then we restart the race in the first lap itself, so that no one is at a. We try and make it as fair for all. 
All right, so as we are going into the restart, um, Arman, uh, as usual uh, with me on the mic, uh, what are your predictions going into race <laughs> one? Hey, man, I don't think we can predict because we have such a we have such a very star-studded uh, star lineup here. And, you know, if everyone just gets through the, the first lap clean, uh, you know, it's a long race. You know, a lot of mistakes could be made. It's just about everyone who keeps clean nose, gets the laps in, use the tires well. Uh, and we know who the strong guys are, but then again, who are the most consistent guys? We don't know. We haven't looked at practice in detail, so we don't know on the long run who's most consistent. And that's going to be something that's really interesting to watch in this first race that we have. Yeah, I agree, 100%. Aditya, I don't know if you're here or not. Uh, unfortunately, I know uh, he's having a couple of technical difficulties. So. Uh, yeah, sorry, Dylan, I think I lost you there. Um. Um, yeah, uh, you're having a couple of te uh, technical difficulties, so I'll fill in the gaps for you um, until you're back, of course. Uh, uh, but, Arman, um, obviously, uh, we've uh, had the restart now, and we're getting ready to form up the grid. Um, we have Amit in first place, uh, Arjun Mayani in second, and if I'm not wrong, I feel like the grid might have not been restarted, because if we look at uh, the... Um, the grid lineup right now it says that Adwait is in third, I NK is in fourth, and uh, Abhishek is in uh, seventh. And yeah, seventh. That, that's basically where they were running on. Um, you know, before we decided to restart the race. So what's happening is now they're just setting the setting the grid again, yeah, and we'll be up and running. The yep, there we are on the grid. There we are. So yeah, now we have the lights that are about to go out. We're about to start the race. Uh, Aman, let's hope for some uh, really clean racing. Uh, at least in the start and then we can see some hard racing going in obviously we've had a restart so these guys know not to make the same moves again and uh, cause that uh, but anything can happen we're having the lights go off we have there three, we have the lights four, three, four, five, five and the lights are out and, 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 and go yeah. let's hope it's clean this time the last start was a bit chaotic but I think this time we may have it better off it looked very similar yeah. actually there was not much difference between this one no, and the there's last a, one there's a big we have a spinner the there yeah, we, there's a big bunch up there at the back the top two have made it clear. Oh, oh no. no, that's not in there, but he's got going, he's got going. No, not in, actually in third place right now. Oh, in fourth right now, Sai is in uh, third. We have a full course yellow again. Uh, what is going to happen? Um, obviously, uh, not the start that we hoped for, but I think everyone has gotten out of it. Uh, the pits are open. And uh, yeah, let's see what happens here. Um, I'm not exactly sure, Aman, uh, is damage on for the race. So if there is damage, then this is going to really impact the race. Otherwise, uh, I think everyone will be ready to go as uh, this first uh, yellow. No, we, 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 you know, since it was such a tie, so we have not put damage on. So we just put it realistic. So right now, everyone is going to be, everyone is fine in terms of the vehicles. Uh, once we go back to green, I think they can resume racing. And you can see the whole field is bunched up again. Which is great because again, you know, people just because again, we will have everyone in a pack and uh, ready to go. Uh, if we can just run through the grid now, it's Amit in the lead with uh, Arjun Mani in second. We've got Sai Sanjay in third. Narain is in fourth. <coughs> so he's made a couple of places there. Uh, we've got Rohit Shankar who's come to fifth. He's made a lot of ground on the first la on the first corner. We've got a big advantage there. He's taking he's taking control there and made the most out of everyone else's else's mishaps. So he's coming from 12th to 5th. We've got Arya again who's made a lot of space. Chewagla. So everyone who started from below the top to top 10 have really come up and made a lot of uh, lot, lot of ground here. It's going to be an exciting race. I'll tell you that much. Yeah, I'm definitely looking yeah, forward we, to it. Yeah, uh, Aditya, take this. Yeah, time. absolutely. And I think uh, Rohan made the most out of it. Uh, yeah, yeah. He's a very calculative driver. We know that. Uh, it's a full course yellow because of the incident at the start. And it's you see how important it is even in the game for these guys to keep their tires warm. Um, and that's really going to help them once the race restarts, once the full course yellow uh, goes green. So it, it's important. Amit's controlling the pace now. It's full course yellow. Everybody has to has to maintain their speed. But it's 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 great to see these guys in their custom livery. Oh, we got the, the safety car out. Okay, yeah. it says full course yellow there, but we've got the safety car out, which is um, which is going to make it all the more interesting. Now everybody is bunched up, but what's good is we're going to have a good restart after. This. Yeah, hundred percent. I mean, yes. <laughs> what it does is it just bunches everyone up. My fingers are crossed just to make sure that uh, they all get off the first lap nice and clean, and we we can start racing from then on. You know, rather than having more safety cars out, um, I'd like to just see a nice clean race and there's some hardcore racing really. Yeah, and and I have to say, Amit is Amit 
fully impressed. I mean, yeah. I can't imagine what it's like to be him right now, sitting in his room, um, <laughs> looking at his mirrors, looking at the likes of Arjun Maini and Naren Karthikeyan in his mirrors. It must be an un. But you know, wa- watching him and then look, and looking at how he's approached every weekend, I don't think he gets faced by. With I think that room thinks about okay, how fast can I go or how can I just beat whoever else I'm racing against? Not actually personalizing who he's actually racing with. I think or against. So I, I uh, unfortunately I was just gone for a sec, so I completely missed the conversation. So I'm gonna just create a new one. <laughs> um, but yeah, we have the full course safety out. Uh, we can see the safety car, very interesting looking safety car. Uh, Arman, is that how safety cars look used to look in the? That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a Chevy. Uh, that's a Corvette. Uh, the, yeah, I'm uh, aware of that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah, um, uh, we have the safety car out. I think uh, if well, I'm not I, wrong, uh, this is the lap that the car comes in. Yeah. So uh, I think the safety car is coming in this lap. Let's just wait as they come down the back straight. Uh, the pit entry is just further ahead. So if we see the safety car peeling off in, then we know it's coming. This lap, the lights are off. Uh, lights seem to be off. We still see a full course yellow and uh, the cars are going extremely slow down the straight so it's possible okay no he's out for another no race. he's staying out all right so this is a interesting turn we expected the pits uh, yeah we've got one more lap behind the safety car the safety car is staying out Alright, but either way, um, as everyone is uh, getting up into the grid, one lap to go for the safety car. Um, obviously, we only have uh, 10 laps, and uh, everything seems to be great in terms of weather. Obviously, we have very good weather every time we have this race because that's just our luck. And now I'm joking. We uh, we set it up to dry weather, and uh, yeah, uh, we have the safety car out. It's coming in this uh, this lap, and. Uh, yeah, we see Amit in first, Arjun uh, trailing right behind him in second, as well as Sai Sanjay, and of course, um, the former Formula One driver, Narin Karthikeyan, who is absolutely killing it, staying on the top of the grid. I mean, I yeah, we no are riding with them right now. No disrespect, right, yeah, we are riding to, the, with them. No disrespect to the other, uh, other drivers here, but uh, man, uh, for NK's first week, uh, he's doing extremely, uh, he's extremely strong, uh, strong pace, and he's keeping it up. No, oh, 100%. And you know, he's a smart racing driver. He's been around for a long time. So, straight away making up places at the start. And, uh, you know, I totally expect him to move move up the grid once the green lights go on. Exactly, exactly. Or, I mean, as I said, uh, anything can happen. I obviously am the type of the guy uh, to give predictions. So, um, obviously, I feel as NK's pace is uh, very, very strong. I do feel like people are going to get the drop on him because that happens. Is NK having a technical difficulty or a mechanical problem? Because his car is smoking a lot. No, no, that, that's just that's just the way the game works, Dylan. Uh, no technical difficulties. I think we're all running smooth. All right, all right. That is. Uh, then he has some uh, really cool effects on his car now. He has some smoke and uh, can distract the other drivers maybe. Right, but either way, we have one more lap. This is the final lap that the safety car is out. And, uh, yeah, obviously the Chevy is going extremely slow, to be honest. Uh, but for all the viewers in here, welcome to the second stream of the day. We had a, a very, very fantastic first uh, stream. Obviously, it was a little delayed. Um, but with that being said, it was such a great race. We had such fast drivers and such close racing. And uh, we should expect the same going into this session as well with these guys being extremely, extremely fast and uh, a good pace all together and uh, obviously we have the safety car out so uh, yeah we it's g- going to be very interesting how the grid changes up uh, obviously we see Sohul Shah in ninth right now he did start third if I'm not wrong and Rohan Shankar who started in the back is now up into fifth and uh, NK has made up two positions uh, from the start especially with this uh, safety car and uh, yeah it's just an overall overall it's just a really strong uh, really strong performance from uh, NK and uh, the and Rohan Shankar as well uh, but yeah as we expect the car to come in and if it makes the right turn then i am wa- uh, extremely wrong about this if, if it makes the right turn i think we're just going to go ahead i think it's coming i think the lights have gone yep, off yep. Come. everyone's going to start uh, now yeah, yeah. green if flag green flag everyone's ready to go yeah 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 man we go racing 
All right, and now that we got the restart sorted and uh, uh, and the safety car sorted out, we can see Arjun Mayani right uh, now in first place and uh, uh, NK just no, in no, fourth. We, we, no, we've got, we've got Amit in first place, Arjun in second, we've got Sai in third, they've all spaced out now, and, and Aryan in fourth, there's a bit of smoke coming out, but... Um, but like, I think that's, that's, that's just some more heating which, which should settle down. Uh, he's pulled out a gap. Uh, he's pulled out a gap there to, to Rohan Shankar. Um, so I think he's looking quite comfortable now. Actually making some time there on Sai Sanjay. Uh, <clears throat> but it's good to go finally go racing again. And uh, you know, let's just see what happens once these guys get settled down at the end of this lap. Man, what incredible racing Amit is up in. Sorry, I meant uh, Amit. I didn't mean to mean uh, say Arjun. I meant Amit is up in first. Uh, keeping that lead, Arjun R Mayani right behind him, not too far behind, as well as Sai Sanjay. And NK is seems to be uh, falling a little bit back. It's hard to tell uh, under one lap, especially since it's been extremely clean so far. It's hard to tell if uh, NK is losing uh, uh, some time to third place. Uh, but either way, uh, Ron Shankar needs to watch out because there is a driver right behind him and uh, that could uh, put a lot of pressure on Rohan Shankar, Arya Singh right behind him and uh, Che Wang Lama as well. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be extremely interesting. We see already these top two have uh, pulled out a lead or top four rather have pulled out a lead uh, from fifth and down. You can see four second gap or even uh, in the, for that matter uh, from NK itself, uh, four second, uh, three second gap now uh, from NK down. Right, uh, from right. The top so, three. so, so we've got Amazon just passed the line. He's done a twenty-four point, uh, twenty-four point five. We've got Arjun right behind him, point four, um, and then uh, then you have the rest of the field. Then you have Sai, who's not that far behind. But again, Narain, who's I think they've all just maintained the same gap. Um, <coughs> they've all done mid twenty-five there. So yeah, they're all the same, all similar lap times. The top five doing similar lap times. They look quite safe, really, uh, and no one's there to really challenge them. But uh, remember, it's it's got. A few laps to go. It's a long race. Uh, it, it, it's very easy to make a mistake here. So it's all about just keeping it consistent. Exactly. I want to run through. I want to run through the you know people who have really lost out. Um, you know uh, after the first lap when the race started, and we see that uh, guys like uh, Satish, Sohil, uh, Vishnu, Advait really fell back quite a bit, uh, and Abhishek as well. Um, but again, guys like uh, Rohan, Arya, and Chewang made places so kudos to them you know a lot of points we scored this uh, this first race yeah exactly and but the problem is is that uh, the gaps are pretty big compared to the top of the grid and the bottom so it's going to be really uh, there's going to be a lot of pressure for rohan shankar uh, to really really keep that fifth place or uh, and or gain on uh, as you can see there's a driver right behind amaria singh just trying to make that move as soon as possible uh, but yeah, Rohan Shankar needs to uh, keep his cool and make sure he doesn't make any mistakes. It seems like he's lost a huge gap. Uh, unfortunately, we don't see that right now. But Rohan Shankar has lost a huge gap uh, uh, to Arya Singh. And uh, that's going to really affect Rohan Shankar's pace because now he has to be uh, extremely careful. Uh, but NK is also uh, just like uh, chilling out. And uh, yeah, Amit and uh, Arjumaini are going back at it. Uh, only four tenths separating them. And uh, yeah, we can expect some. Uh, close yeah, this races. is gonna be a this is this is gonna be a really good race to watch. These two are uh, like really hammering it down um, and pushing each other, you know. So I mean, it's easier for Arjun because he's just gonna put the pressure on the car in front. It's more difficult for Amit, who's just gotta you know uh, soak up the pressure and just focus and just keep it consistent. Um, as you can see, further back you got Sai there entering the hairpin, who's just coming and exit. Further back, yeah, Narain. His car looks, seems to have settled down as well. Uh, there was some smoke coming out earlier, like you had called it, Dylan. But now things have settled down. I think that was just, you know, when they, when you're in first and second gear for a long period of time, it just tends to overheat, and we've kept it as realistic as possible. So that was what you, you people were watching on screen. But now, as the as the wind, as 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 the, you know, fresh air is coming through his his, his air box, uh, things have really uh, his engine has started behaving itself as well. Here's Amit coming through the last one. Coming past the wall of champions, you know, because a lot of people have actually gone to that wall there. Famously, Michael Schumacher did uh, a couple of years ago. Uh, but yeah, coming to the first corner, uh, <clears throat> looks like we're close to ha we're halfway through the race here. Uh, we've gone past the chicane there, uh, and these two are really one, one, you can't separate them, you know. Uh, I really can't tear them apart. It reminds me of the 2011 Formula One race where Jensen Button really chased down Vettel and then, you know, in the damn circuit ended up getting yeah. in the last lap. <laughs> yeah, this reminds me of that uh, Jensen Button chasing down. But here's Dry River, Arjun uh, obviously chasing Amit down. So it's a different scenario. But um, you have to remember, Amit's a gamer. Arjun's a, a race driver, raced up to Formula 2. 
uh, was a Haas junior driver. Uh, Amit, on the other hand, 16 years old, r- literally no experience in a real race car. But just just look at him. He's soaking up the pressure from a Formula 2 driver. So far, no mistakes. I hope the commentator curse doesn't get to him. But uh, it's unbelievable to watch a 16-year-old actually drive the way he's driving. And any game, give him any game. We saw him in Assetto Corsa. We saw him in Formula 1. Any game, and he's still able to pull it off. He's consistent. He's clean. He's quick. Um, and he's really giving... The guys who we we believe are the best a real run for their money. But while we speak, we've got Arjun in his slipstream, and it looks like he's going. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> was Arjun uh, getting really close to the wall there? <laughs> scraping the wall, scraping the wall there. The fastest lap is oh, a new wall of so championship. He has just gained a lead <laughs> on him. Arjun has gained the lead for sure. We can see the gap is pretty much uh, non-existent at this point. Um, but yeah, as we said, uh, the commentators curse. I think it might be. Uh, dripping down on Amit's neck uh, because now we've uh, kind of uh, ruined the gap for him. Uh, but no, but going, going by going by what Aditya said, uh, it's like any platform that we've run over the last three weeks, he's just been in the top three, you know, whether it's Formula 1, I said, of course, uh, whatever it was. So it's great, you know, and, and, and it's fantastic to see the, the mix you know, of gamers and racing drivers and racing drivers being really quick <clears throat> and like someone like Nareen, Nareen as well, uh, who's not Authentic uh, esports or simulator driver, but now coming in and straight away being in the top part of the top four, you know, uh, it's it's phenomenal, and that just goes to show the, uh, how you can just adapt to different situations uh, and different yeah. uh, vehicles. Yeah, of course. And and I, I would love, really love to see an onboard of uh, Rohan Chunker right now because I'm looking at the time streams and it looks like Rohan is uh, is actually oh, closing oh. in on the rain. Yeah, and and that could actually be a good battle to watch. So would love to watch Rohan right now. Yeah, if I broadcast a day, is yep. Yeah. As I said, he's got to keep the pressure up. Uh, obviously, RSN is right behind him now. So, Oil Shah has actually made up uh, three positions uh, after the uh, restart with the safety car. So, uh, yeah, So Hill Shah up into seventh now. Obviously, he's lost positions, but uh, yeah, up into seventh from the restart. Well, so, guys, I, I think, w- yeah, I think I'm that was Rowan just coming a little sideways out of, the, out of the corner there, but that Arya having a look. Uh, oh, oh, he's oh, lost oh. it, Ron but he held it. No, he held it, he held it, he held it. He almost lost it, but he held it. Unfortunately, he's lost the place, but he's saved. He's only lost the place instead of the race. So, you know, he, and still, all he this, can recover. It, yeah. yeah, he can recover. And all this, Narayan's managed to just pull a bit of a gap from Rohan. Rohan was doing a really good job, and, and Arya too, just slowly sneaking in on Narayan. But I think Arya, Arya got a bit impatient and wanted to make that place up. Um, we don't have too many laps to go. We've got a lap and a half. Um, so it's going to be interesting to see really who can do what at this stage. But Arjun is fighting hard. Arjun is really pushing up hard. <laughs> yeah, I mean, think about it. I mean, uh, I mean, yeah, Arjun goes. I mean, so as a racing driver, oh, there's an incident there. Uh, no, but I, Arjun, you know, we go and test on an actual race car for like a whole day. But here, as a gamer, you test on your sim in your own house. You can spend six, seven, eight hours testing in that same room, you know. For and free, that shows how and a cheap price. <laughs> Oh, of course, of course, and dam- no damage bills. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, Arjun looking towards the inside. Has he made the move? Uh, is he made the move? Oh, oh, oh this is, he's going to stay around the outside, but, but Amit's holding on to it. This is, this is unbelievable <laughs> stuff we're watching he here, ladies and gentlemen. This is great. Oh, Amit's on to that one. Two youngsters here. One's a 16-year-old in the lead, and you're followed by a 22, 21, 20-year-old in second place. Both pushing each other really hard. Really clean, well-respected racing as well. Um, you know, it's the last lap. It's the last lap, guys. Yes, is it the last lap? Are we on the last lap? This is unbelievable stuff. We're watching the battle for the lead on the last lap right now. Uh, who's it going to be? <laughs> I would really love to see Ahmed hold on to his lead. I can't believe he's, he's just a gamer and he's got the pressure of having Narain in the race. Arjun Maini in his rearview mirror is hounding him right through. This is he's unbelievable a, stuff. He's a 16-year-old kid, Aditya. And he's holding him on all, 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 all year for dear life. Uh, they're coming down the back straight. He's just got one chicken left to go. But remember, they have DRS as well. DRS is a drag reduction system, so your rear wing flag comes down, So, which means Arjun will have that top speed down the straight. Is he going to make the move around the outside? Has he got oh it? Oh my god, it's the Has last he lap. He's going on the outside. Oh, oh, no, oh, Amit has oh, held it. Oh my god. Amit has held it. Wait, there's a... Oh, it's Amit Kuti. Is it going to be Amit? Is it going to be Amit? Is it going to be Arjun? I can't say right now. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, what a race, ladies and gentlemen. Unbelievable stuff. 
That's a real firecracker. And someone said that after the second GT race, we wouldn't have a fire. Formula cars, and you'll see the. But we have, ladies and gentlemen. What a race that was. What a race. In third comes in Sai Sanjay, a very well calm race. And then fourth, we have Narain in his first esports race with Azmini. A great result there. But what a, what a fight, guys. What a fight with the first two. Unbelievable. Man, these uh, these guys, as we as I have predicted, these guys were just gonna go at it. Amit and Arjun just have a really really strong pace, and they're they're really showing that they've got what it takes. More than the pace, I think it's just a consistency, and then you know, clean the cleanliness in the battle. Really, there was no you know they didn't really hit each other with of the sports events, but they were just side by side, um, and you know, just giving each other just about enough room. But wow, wow a superb race, you know, like some really good stuff. Really mature drives. For sure. For I mean, it's sure. great. It's great that uh, yeah, and uh, and Arjun. I mean, great stuff from Arjun. We saw him. He could have been so tempted to really like to really just close the door on Amit there at the end, but 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 he gave Amit his space. It was a. It was the last corner. It was entering the chicane, and I think Arjun was just about ahead of him. But but uh, great sportsmanship there by Arjun. And super job there by. I do want to note yeah. uh, for everyone uh, uh, to uh, you know stick in around for a bit longer. We do have one more race to go uh, of this incredibly close racing, and uh, hopefully, not gonna have a restart. But uh, yeah, uh, stick around. We're gonna have another race about yeah. to start in the next couple of minutes. Yeah, stay with us, guys. Remember, race two, the top eight are reverse grid. So the guy who finished eighth will start in in, in on pole. Uh, I think that was Advait, if I'm not wrong. Uh, and you know, this is just basically what mixes things around. Um, and yeah, you just stay with us. We're going to be back on track in a couple of minutes, and I get plenty more excitement in store from from us. For sure, for sure. Aman, uh, as we wait for the grid to be reset, uh, and uh, as everyone uh, you know starts to get up on the grid, what are your predictions with the first race? What are your predictions? Obviously, Amit is an extremely, <coughs> extremely young and fast driver. He's uh, my age to be precise, uh, which is 16. And uh, yeah, like he's just extremely fast. Oh, we uh, do we have the grid already? Uh, no, if I'm not wrong, we don't. Um, but yeah, they're just extremely fast. And also at the same time, uh, I think uh, Amit did want to start his racing career this year. But unfortunately, with the growing uh, pandemic, uh, I think everything has been put as, uh, put on hold, especially my stuff uh, with racing. And uh, yeah, I mean, uh, with that, he's not letting the time slide. And you know, this is his third win in a row. Uh, from last weekend and uh, yeah, let's see how long he can keep that um, and yeah, he's just he's just extremely fast just extremely consistent and extremely fast and uh, Formula one weekend he blew my mind with that 126 at uh, Silverstone So yeah, let's uh, we can expect a lot more from him uh, coming into this weekend and uh, the weekends to come I no doubt about that 100% um <laughs> I mean, I think uh, good, there were a couple of good recovery drives there. You know, some good, um, mature, uh, consistent drives around the field. I mean, you had Sai and Narain who just held it consistent, you know, drove to their pace and finished in the positions that they made up of the first lap. We saw Rohan who made up the place first lap, Rohan, Rohan and Arya. And then, you know, even though he nearly lost to the end, just held it together. Um, and then, yeah, the winners, obviously. I mean, I'm sure Soil and Advait want to make amends for win race two, you know, because they are they do have strong pace uh, and they don't want to get involved and they probably want to go try staying out of trouble. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's all to play for, guys. It's all to play for. You know, I do want to mention something. Uh, talking strategies with you, Aman. Uh, in GT3, uh, you know, uh, or Formula 1 as well, uh, you know, it's a lot of strategies. And... Uh, now that we have the reverse uh, reverse grid going, I feel like uh, Narayan Karthikeyan put himself in a really really good uh, strategic position, uh, because if it is top eight, if I'm not wrong, which is uh, it's a top eight uh, reverse grid, that means uh, Narayan Karthikeyan is starting fourth place, uh, and that's where he exactly ended. Uh, so that's very smart placement by him because uh, now he's not compromised by the reverse grid at all. Uh, he's kind of just the middleman, and he's gonna stay there. Yeah, hundred percent. Uh, I mean, we know what Narayan's caliber, and you saw this immediately at the start. How he, you know, even though he's involved in multiple made up places and move forward, and and you know, and, and finish a commendable fourth place, and now starting again fourth, you never know if you, if there's no if there isn't an incident in the first corner, you um you might just see him in the top three and then pushing from there onwards. You know, uh, 
Dom the quicker guys the back he still holds his ground you know and so because of the consistency that he portrays so um i i think this game uh, this race is is going to create a lot more drama in, in the midfield as well because you're going to have guys who trying to be who are going to be coming up the ranks really um but <clears throat> well we should be up in the next 5 minutes so stick around guys and you're always welcome to tune in play from the earlier gt race that we had and also race 1 which just got, got concluded and i do also want to mention something uh we are having races on the ps4 as well as the pc uh and uh planning for the future you know we do have races where we have uh, the audience and uh, other drivers who are uh, huge influencers as well and uh, you know are in love with racing in general uh, you guys can give your uh, your take your, you know give it a shot and uh, go and try qualifying for the race and uh, you never know it could be you in the t- uh, in this great order you could be racing our incarnate king maybe maybe and uh, yeah like you you might have some chances obviously with the ps4 grid uh, uh, for gt sport uh, that grid is completely made up of uh, you know of uh, people who have qualified uh, top 16 so it's it's really uh, it it could really be you if if you really tried hard enough no 100% i mean look at the opportunity that even like for example you you as a gamer then now wouldn't it be great to be involved with you know accomplished racing drivers who are there right now competing and it's great exposure for yourself as well right Exactly, exactly, and uh, <coughs> yeah, I mean, especially when uh, I, uh, as I was a part of the X1 uh, esports, I did get a lot of exposure from that as well. Uh, so yeah, I mean, uh, I am a streamer and stuff as well. So it did help out a lot with uh, uh, myself as well as uh, what I'm capable of doing, and uh, I think I have fallen in love with racing and uh, deep into that rabbit hole. Yeah, hundred percent. I mean, more yeah. sport is is so like once you get involved, you really can't. and you're going to be involved some way or the other exactly exactly but either way we're about to start uh, a couple more minutes as we do the uh, reverse grid and uh, guys tune in get some food get some dinner and uh, you know most importantly uh, stay at home obviously uh, uh, the pandemic is quite crazy and uh, it's it is causing a lot of uh, disturbance with uh, everyone's daily lifestyle So uh yeah that's why we're doing this obviously we can't have real races going on and uh, this is our our compensation for that and uh yeah I mean I mean Dylan just looking at all the you all the comments on YouTube and Twitch you know people have just been a lot of people have been tuning in we've got Shubham Das who's like wow we've got couple uh, couple A's we've got uh, Indian car scene we've got various people have tuned in you know uh, Silesh um uh <coughs> <coughs> and then we've got in got a club for Mumbai Car Sim Racer Club. Uh, yes, yeah, so a lot of people tuning in really and enjoying uh, what Ultimate E are putting out there. So, uh, you know, thanks a lot for tuning in, guys, and stick around for race two of tonight and then tomorrow join us again as well. Uh, this is our third weekend. Um, this is our third weekend in the row uh, that we've been hosting uh, races on different platforms, and I think uh, each weekend has just been getting more and more exciting, really. uh which uh, i mean man uh, it's it's been it's been a it's been great really yeah, yeah today's race was unbelievable guys i mean i can't believe we we, we watched uh, gran turismo just before this and <laughs> that was great but this was also really great to see again just just think about it you put yourself in amit's boots he's got guys like arjun <laughs> maini in his rearview mirror he's got narin kartikeyan on i i wonder what's going through his mind really because he's got to hold on to that lead he's leading the race he's is nothing but a gamer at the end of the day and it must be an unbelievable feeling but while we speak um we get back Arthur, on the grid for the next but, race yeah but while we do the raj i think about it he's in room in comfort zone uh, you know doing what he does every for many hours a day right you know and so just excelling in his comfort zone basically you know which is great i but do again, want to have, mention I, I, uh we as do you can see the, all the cars on the grid yeah we have 1 2 3 Four and five lights yeah, right all... now, and the lights are out off, and away. We we'll go off. with the first, uh, second race of the race one, uh, race day one, and it has been an oh, extremely close. Oh, super stuck there by Sohil, guys. Oh, oh no! no. Oh, and he's just running around in a bunch oh, of guys spinning around the wheel. Oh, what is going on here? Oh, 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 sure, oh, this is oh, going to be safety safety car, safety 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 car. Car. crazy stuff safety here. Car. I'm pretty sure this is going to be a restart. Oh, there's someone flipped around. Yeah, no, I think it's going to be a restart. There's too much chaos.
That's a lot of chaos. Yes, that's a restart. That purple um, card really that's a lot that went down there. <laughs> but, look at Ahmed coming. <laughs> I'm going to stop there. Ahmed always keeps his nose clean. He's in the lead. <laughs> Ahmed is Ahmed is next level. Even with all that chaos, he's still oh, man. persevering. Unbelievable. Ahmed. Ladies and gentlemen, we're watching a superstar here. Uh, we definitely are looking at a superstar of the future. Yeah. <laughs> Ahmed needs to take these skills into a real car ASAP. I was talking to him about that. I asked, him, I asked him after the first week, and he said he he's tested a junior level single seat of the Formula LG. <laughs> because maybe now it's time to make that switch into actual into actual cars, you know? Exactly. <laughs> I was actually uh, during uh, last weekend. I was actually uh, since he had a PS4. That's the only time I really get to play with the people, especially like Amit, uh, and we actually did get a couple races on. Uh, and yeah, like uh, it was fun to uh, race with him and. Uh, have the opportunity to see how, uh, what he's capable of, and yeah, he's definitely fast. We had some really close racing as well, uh, but yeah, he's extremely consistent, and uh, I can tell you uh, firsthand experience that uh, it's not someone you want to take lightly. He's a very shy person in general. He doesn't really talk a lot, uh, but yeah, he he w whatever he d uh, doesn't do talking, he puts it in the car, and uh, really shows that shows his talking in the car and how he drives it. All right, so we're going to take uh, – the race is going to start extremely soon, uh, so I uh, urge you guys to stay around here. Obviously, we have to have a restart with that uh, with that, um, with that, uh, that horrible start. We had so many cars get involved. Uh, but yeah, yeah. In, the, in the meanwhile, uh, Dylan, while the, while the grid is being set, these guys are allowed to, to, to warm up, just get themselves uh, uh, ready for the race. Uh, so we're just, we just have to set the grid all over again because it's restart. Um, but meanwhile, these guys are allowed to go out and do a warm-up, uh, just, just be in touch before the race starts again. Which is great, actually, in this game. They don't have to sit in the pit and wait for, for the race start to happen. Uh, just keep yeah. themselves ready. Yeah, what is called, basically, in real life, we have it as well. It's called, we have the installation laps, you know. So, every time the pit lane is open for about 10, you know, 10 minutes and uh, we can get out, we can get off our garage and go do installation laps uh, before going into the grid, you know. So it's the same thing, the same procedure has been followed here as well. While we set the grid, basically, everyone is just going to their car feels okay and prepare themselves for race two. So obviously, you guys have a bunch of experience on your hands as well. You guys were in GT3 and especially a lot of, uh, a lot of racing in India as well. Uh, looking at uh, from your time at racing to the day and age right now, especially last year's racing, you have uh, drivers like Arjun Mayani, and uh, you know his brother as well is extremely fast. We saw some great racing uh, in their in your X1 league, and uh, yeah, it was it was extremely close racing all throughout uh, Chennai and Delhi. Uh, what do you think about the racing now compared to when you guys uh, were racing? I don't mean to s make you guys sound old or anything, but uh, I meant you know uh, at this caliber. Yeah, I mean, Dylan, to answer your question, um, <laughs> we're not, I mean, yeah, okay, to say we're all competitive. Um, just like uh, having watched Arjun and Kush in the X1 Racing League as well as Naren, we have to remember, I mean, Naren's been racing even before Kush was born. Exactly. But just to see the kind of lap times that Naren was putting in, unbelievable. I mean, even at his age, he's 42 years old now. He, he won the Super GT race at the end of the year last year. Right so he's still, he's still really sharp. Right before X1, exactly. Just a couple of weeks before X1 Racing League. So, I mean, Narin is still really sharp. He's new to gaming. It's something that wasn't around in his in his younger years. So, all this that he's doing now is, is fairly new to him. But, I mean, great of him to be on board. That way, Narin's always been a super sport about stuff like this. He loves his racing. As long as he gets behind the steering wheel, whether it's a video game or a real car, as long as he's driving... He's happy, and I think that's just what it is with any real race drivers, with Arman and me, and um, with with Arjun and with Push. Push and Arjun spend a lot of time driving as well. Exactly, exactly, and uh, I did want to touch on that again. You know, we have uh, back when you guys were racing. Obviously, uh, the racing was we had a bunch of we had uh, 
Narin Katakin, we had uh, um, uh, Karun Chandok as well as his father. You know, they're all big in racing, especially in India. And uh, I mean, on average, I meant uh, when I talk about this day and age racing, on average, do we see more drivers uh, in closer and fast racing? Obviously, uh, you can't compare to Narayan Kadkin and Karun Chandok. Those guys in their age, in, in their day and age were really, really fast and still are fast. You see, Narayan Kadkin is still on top of the grid, uh, even though he's brand new to this. So, um, what do you think about the racing uh, right now? On average, obviously, the racing community in India has gotten much bigger uh, compared to back then. But uh, I with that bigger community, do you think the racing has gotten uh, faster or it's not really improved that much or it's gone down from when you guys were racing? I Obviously. mean, racing is racing. Motorsport has always been competitive, um, whether it was then or now. Obviously, the technology changes, machinery changes as years go by, it gets safer. Um, you have a, a, a lot of drivers now who want to get to the top. So it gets very competitive as years go by. But again, Nare never had it easy. You can't you can't uh, say that, you know, it was different then than now. Yeah. It was always tough for Nare. It's still tough for Arjun. It's still tough for guys like Jahan Darawala. Always going to be. This sport is a really niche that way. And, 100%. You know, you've got 100%. To, yeah, and you've got to have that talent that comes from within you. It's very important. But, uh, but again... Um, it, the, the fact that you're able to able to have uh, sim racing, you've got uh, it's it's great to really see guys who've never really driven a race car versus people who've been at the pinnacle racing on the same grid. Now that's something in many sports you don't really get to see, and and to have someone like Amit kind of to be ahead of the field, it's great. Any anyway, while we speak, I think we have everybody now who are going to be on the grid. Yeah, the grid is starting to. And line the restart up. is going to happen now, so I uh, think this I'm is going to be uh, the. Sorry. Yeah, uh, sorry guys, I'm back. I'm back. As, I'm back as well. Like. Yeah, I'm on right before the grid starts. Uh, not everyone is on the grid right now, but right before the grid starts, uh, do you have uh, any uh, very quick answer to that? Uh, with the question that was asked earlier, I don't know if you were here for it or not. But either way, the lights are off. We can talk about it after the race. And four, five lights are out, and and the lights are out now. And they're off. They're off. They're ready to go. Sohil Shah up into first place. Uh, no, uh, do I deal that? Yeah. Oh, there's some crashing and uh, banging going around fingers in the back. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. They seem to have got past clean. They seem to have got past clean. There's oh a bit no! Of collision someone's gone out. Oh, oh, oh. But uh, this is a much cleaner start compared to the uh, the race before this, and uh, yep. yeah, it's much better. No yellow flags are out. No safety car. I mean, uh, obviously there are yellow flags, but. Green flags are out, that means everyone can overtake. Advait Dilda in second, Sohil Shah in first, Arya Singh in third, and Maini running in fourth right now. Uh, Narin Kartikeyan right behind him. Uh, Amit, I think Amit had gotten involved. Amit is down to into 14th place. What bad luck, unfortunately. Yeah, we saw him getting involved. We saw him getting involved in an incident uh, coming out of turn one. Um, you know, unfortunately, but the rest have got off to a clean start. Sohil seems to be in the lead. Um, yeah, I think Narain's down there in fifth, in fifth, so Narain's lost the place as well. Um, but, but yeah, it's a lot cleaner than earlier, so, um, so let's, let's get down to racing, guys, and yeah, you, you, we know how these guys can overtake. Let's see where Arjun is as well. Yeah, I mean, uh, Arjun is, uh, right behind in fourth place. He's made up his positions that he needed to. Un unfortunately, Amit has, uh, gotten involved, so he's down into 13th right now. But Narin Kartikin has actually gained a position coming into fourth right now. Is he? Will he be able to get up into the podium? That would be a huge, huge accomplishment, especially this uh, considering this is brand new for him. That would be huge. Uh, and like, yeah, I mean, Arjun Maini is running in third place right now, gaining the time very, very quickly. Uh, you can see that he's already down uh, under two seconds now. You can see 1.5 already. And yeah, he's just gaining a lot of time in general. Advait Deoda has to... Uh, yeah, we've, we've got Sohil and Advait really racing uh, neck neck. I mean, Advait stretched un in Sohil's gearbox really. And while that's happening, Arjun just tripping away and catching up with them. Narain staying with Arjun and just following right through. So we could see a four-way battle here, you know, uh, between the four of them. Um, <clears throat> And which is really exciting because you have four top top guys, top racing drivers here gunning for the the, the, the top three podium positions, really. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. And I, I do want to talk about that. Sohil Shah is, uh, had uh, 
tremendously bad luck uh, first race, but uh, you can see that now he's keeping it up into the second race. Will he be able to get his first ever uh, race? Oh wait, no, this will be his second race when he had a win in uh, Monza. Uh, if I'm not wrong, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, uh, Arman, it, it, it was Monza and uh, Sohil Chah did uh, persevere and get a, a race one, or uh, a first place. But as you, can, as you can see, every time the cars are on the straight, they've got the DRS open, the drag reduction system. Uh, this basically gives them more top speed, but, um, but obviously no aerodynamics, so that's why it's only on the straights. Uh, but what that does, it also helps the slipstream, and then, you know, they can, they, they really get, <clears throat> get to, it help, basically helps in overtaking and help in, in to guys uh, planning, the, planning to make a move. Um, the top three are really, have just creep, crept away a bit from Narain, but I think Narain, uh, but if they start to fight, you'll find Narain under their gearbox again. Uh, Amit, who lost out quite a lot in the start, he's making his way oh, back. Someone he's has made a make, move. He's making a move here. That's Amit there, he's making another move and just chipping away and finding his way back up the field. Uh, you can see he's come back to 8th place now. I, I think as the race goes on, he'll definitely make it back into the top 5 at least. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Uh, you can see he's come back to 8th place now. I, I think as so the race goes on, he'll definitely make it back into the top 5 at least. So we see a little bit of echo, but uh, without, with that being said, um, yeah, yeah I mean, Abhishek is in... Uh, uh, Abhishek is right now in 6th place. He also had a really bad start uh, for race 1. But he's also <laughs> up. We have Narin Karthikeyan in 4th place again. And Adwait in 3rd. Uh, as well as... Oh, I actually, as we've uh, mentioned, Adwait has uh, lost position. Arjun Maini has gained that position. So it's going to be a really close race now. Sohil Shah versus Arjun Maini. Unfortunate for Amit uh, to be uh, punted down into... Uh, was 14th place. He's gained uh, quite a few positions now. And he's in 8th place. Uh, and uh, running strong. Uh, he's just uh, gaining on 7th place right now, and uh, Abhishek is also going to have to watch out for uh, for Amit coming up. But either way, Arya Singh running in 5th, NK in 4th, Adwait in 3rd, Arjun Maini in 2nd, and Sohil Shah in 1st. Arjun Maini is only 1.1 seconds behind. He's gaining so much time on uh, Sohil Shah, but uh, yeah, let's see how this goes as we uh, inch into... Uh, the uh, third lap now, starting the third lap, and uh, yeah, we can see uh, quite a bit of uh, good racing going on here. Yeah, definitely, there's 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 there's, there's racing going on all, all over the field. I mean, there we look at down, we look at these two as well who were fighting it out. I'm not sure who that was really. It's in ninth and tenth place, uh, ninth, tenth, eleventh, and twelfth. Uh, yeah, I think that's uh, uh, that's uh, that's sort of there in the white Saurav, car. Yeah. We've got Satish, yeah, Satish behind him, uh, and Rohan and Vishwas. So it's, uh, it's between the four of them here. Oh, oh, Rohan, we saw early. Oh, oh is that there? Rohan again? Is that? Oh my God, Rohan's had a really terrible race this time. Uh, too many incidents there. Too many after that star drive in race one, just getting into too many little incidents in race two, like you said. <coughs> but let's go. Let's go ahead to the leaders and see what's going on because I think this gap is has opened up a bit. Uh, we see Narain there in fourth, followed by uh, Arya in fifth. And then Amit's actually made it to seventh now, so he's making his way up the order. Uh, but can will Arjun is Arjun going to be able to catch up with Sohil? That's the big uh, that's the big question. If our broadcast could, could take us to uh, could take us to the to, to one of the leading cars, uh, we'd be able to track them. For sure, for sure. I mean, uh, we have uh, the leaders. Obviously, just really. I mean, Arjun Maini is just keeping that pace up. We've seen him with a set of Corsa, and now our factor two. He is just keeping his pace up. You can see he's gained so much time on Sohil Shah. Sohil Shah feels the pressure, and uh, he's gonna have to gonna be uh, very careful and make sure he doesn't make any mistakes. Uh, oh. And yeah, I mean uh, Sohil Shah needs to be extremely precautious. He's only now uh, Arjun Maini is five tenths down on him. So yeah, it's gonna be extremely extremely close. Maybe even going down into the last lap like Arjun uh, and Amit, uh, maybe. But as I say, uh, talking about Amit, he's actually gained a position on Saurav, so that puts him from 8th into 7th. And he's actually made the move. Oh, Amit is... Amit had made a move. Amit is now in 6th, 7th place. As we, watch, we watch, as, we watch Arjun, as we watch Arjun lining up Sohil, is he going to make a move? No, Sohil goes defensive into the last corner. But will they get a good drive out? Just very close, rubbing against the wall. This could, this could also work in Adwait's favour. There you see Narain in the background entering the main straight. Arjun, is he going to try and dive in the inside the in the first corner into turn one? He got, he's got, he's got him. Is he, is he, is he going to go around the outside now? Sohil's going to keep the inside, push him out wide. Arjun gets in the dirty stuff, gets a bit sideways there and has to keep it in second. But uh, he's looking again. He's definitely got stronger pace here, but Sohil's really going, doing a good job in defending. What this does is it helps Advait make up some time and close the gap there. 
and eventually if this continues you'll find the rain down uh, join the pack as well and that could be a whole four way fight which could be really interesting some really good racing up and down the field as you guys you said amit's moved up to seventh as well so that's another four places i mean seven places that he's made so there's racing going going on right up and down the field uh, you know that uh, it's, it's really exciting to watch <clears throat> Yeah, but it's these top three we've got to keep an eye on. It's it, Arjun has come all the way from seventh place on the grid. Um, and he's fighting with Sohil now for the lead, and we've got uh, Advait is not giving up. Advait dropped back a little bit, but I think when Arjun fought with Sohil earlier on, earlier on in the lap, uh, Advait managed to cap, uh, catch up with him. So it's going to be a good battle for the next few laps. Where we've got uh, another two laps to go after this, and we're watching Amit right now. Amit's going to gain a place. Um, I think that's on Abhishek Dwaraknath. um and back to the legal yeah so like you said adwe is just waiting there you know waiting for something to happen and just make make the most out of it you know he's just waiting for some action really to go go on ahead of him yep and as we coming on we coming towards the end of the race uh can't really can't really sit down here walking up and down because it's, the battles are so close you know right round right right through the order um so is doing a great job so far and holding and holding everyone back hasn't made a mistake um has put the car in the right places arjun you know he has the pace but can he find a way past arjun uh, adwait's there to pick up the pieces you've got narain further back who you know if they keep fighting might just be able to close the gap um amit and adwait uh, amit and uh, Ab Ab abhishek are not that close to each other will amit get ahead of the abhishek or will be able to hold him back uh, lots of lots of time not many laps left guys not many laps left So yeah I mean uh, obviously we are uh, having a really really good race going in obviously this is extremely extremely close racing we have uh, Sohil Shah in first place just trying to keep Arjun Maini out uh, and trying to keep him away we only have another 3 laps if I'm not wrong or 2 laps and uh, yeah it's going to be really really interesting We have Amit right now in 6th place he's just gaining and gaining as much We're as possible We're on the final lap then we're on the final lap We're on the so final. This, oh yeah, this eight laps. We're on the final lap, so it's now or never. You know, they've only got about four and a half more meters to to make the move or not. It's only uh, so between Sol and Arjun as because Arjun has dropped back on this lap. I think he made a mistake on the last corner of the of the penultimate lap. We're on the last lap now, um, and the top six basically Sohil, Arjun, Advait, Narain, um, Arya, and Amit. Uh, Amit's gone past Abhishek Dwaraknath as well. So. As of now, that's the top six. Are we going to find any changes? I think only the top two are close enough to make that happen. Exactly. So it's going to be a close battle now between Arjun and uh, and so it's uh, it's all down to the slips here. Oh, oh my no, God! Did he just make a mistake there? Did he just make a mistake? It's just it's it's open the door for Arjun. Remember, there's DRS, uh -huh. there's DRS on this straight, so Arjun's going to be slips team plus DRS, so he's going to close the gap there. So it's going to keep it on the inside but he's, can Arjun go on the outside he tried this with Amit it didn't happen oh no i don't oh. think so but so oh no he's first. lost it so Arjun Mine has made it <laughs> Arjun Mine you wins the race oh, i cannot believe what just happened i cannot believe I what i'm saying i can't Arjun believe so he messed it up but Arjun wins the race what a race by Arjun the piece is so hard chest but makes it in third with Narain finishing in fourth i can't believe he lost on the last lap there What a race, guys! What a race! And to round up the top ten, we had Arya in fifth, Amit in sixth, Abhishek Dwarak not seventh. <laughs> I think uh, I saw. I think we had even Ron Shankar can complete complete the top ten uh, and Vishnu Prasad. What a race, guys! What a race! Yeah, I mean, like these guys, Arjun Maini made the move, tried it in the first race, didn't make it happen, and then he got it on the second race. Unfortunate for Sohil Shah, he had spun out. on the last corner unfortunate but uh, either way he still takes the podium after leading the race and uh, yeah it was just an overall great race uh, some really really great racing we obviously have more of this to come tomorrow as well as GT Sport so yeah let's see how it goes and uh, yeah uh, uh, aman what are your thoughts on the race <laughs> man i have so many thoughts right now <laughs> <laughs> and i'm sweating as hell but uh, i mean so is everything right 
uh, from start to almost the finish, uh, and then just losing it on that last corner of the last lap, just letting pressure get to him finally. And uh, yeah, Arjun, Arjun and Adwe, top job. Arjun put the pressure, put the pressure, and finally came out uh, on top, you know. And then Adwe picked up the pieces, like I told you, just waiting for something to happen. So good comeback drive for him after being involved in incidents in race one. Uh, third place was Soil again, uh, you know, luckily enough, uh, you know, luckily enough he could get the car recovered. And Narain, a very consistent performance in the first eSports event, two fourth places, lots of points in the bag. Sure, he's going to be much stronger tomorrow, but a great job from Narain Katsukin as well. Um, yeah, two lot, fourth lot, places. Lot. Yeah, it's really strong there. Then we have Arya, who, you know, who hasn't been testing, but has come and gotten some valuable points. Amit, with a great recovery drive as well. So. Good drives all round, all round, um, all over the grid. Sorrow also recovered quite a bit. Um, but really exciting stuff, guys. I can't wait for tomorrow. Tomorrow's another action packed day. So join us tomorrow for we start off at 7 in the evening with GD Sport. Uh, you know, that's really exciting as well. We, uh, we've got a cracker lineup there. And then to finish it off in Interlago, Sao Paulo with, uh, with, us, with our All Stars. Yeah, and uh, yeah, so obviously, as Arman just said, we have another day of full action past ra uh, action packed racing, and I'm ex extremely excited, as uh, as I am sure you are, uh, Arman, for the uh, for tomorrow's races. Obviously, four races that is the most we've ever done in a weekend so far, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be a full on action packed uh, like three hours of racing. So yeah, you guys gotta come on and watch. Get your friends, get some food and uh, some water watch it on your screens we're going to be live tomorrow from seven o'clock so yeah i'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, close it up i hope uh, you All guys right. have a great good night job. good uh, job good job swaggy yeah All right thank you cheers i'll see you in the group yeah see ya and uh, for the rest of uh, everyone else i hope you guys have a great night and uh, stay safe and stay